My name is Dr. Dean Miller and I'm the Director of Science and Media with the Great Barrier Reef Legacy. Great Barrier Reef Legacy is a non-profit organisation that aims to crew and operate research vessels uh, to be able to provide free access for scientists, educators and communicators. The Great Barrier Reef doesn't just belong to us in Australia, it belongs to everyone, to the global population and uh, everyone should have a stake in its future. It's understanding how, where and why corals are surviving and until we answer some of those fundamental questions we're not going to be able to save coral reefs. This expedition is absolutely unique in the way that we've been able to attract uh, some of the best marine scientists in the, uh, the coral bleaching space. We're going to make available all the photos, all the videos and all the data points from our expedition to anyone on the planet. We have uh, a range of scientific teams, some are focusing on uh, mapping of the coral reef areas using drones and, and underwater camera systems. Uh, we have teams that are looking at the genetics and molecular uh, structure of corals and why they're able to survive, others that are looking at the biophysical properties of the water and surrounding environment. We've got teams that are collecting live coral samples that are being taken back to Townsville and put in uh, a sea simulator where they'll be bred up uh, to become the super stock of corals for the future. We are collecting a phenomenal amount of data each and every day in terms of uh, cameras we're pulling in probably about three to four terabytes of footage. Uh, the mapping uh, teams that are working out on the reef are collecting about 20,000 images per day uh, and on top of that all the other science teams are actually collecting lots and well probably hundreds of thousands of data points so you can imagine uh, having that amount of information stored in one place needs to be safe, reliable uh, and not only that we're out at sea so we're in a, a salty air environment, uh, the, the boat's constantly moving. We've got a, a QNAP NAS system uh, which has 12 bays and then we've got 12 Seagate uh, Iron Wolf drives that, we, um, that we've put into there, each of those being 12 terabytes so they're absolutely huge. The real strength of having the system on board that we have uh, is that you can have multiple users uploading information after each and every dive and that's you know 10 to 12 users at a time uh, all, all uploading uh, all the data points that they've gathered, all the photos, all the videos then to be able to have our media team directly pull things off that drive at the same time so we can be creating that content uh, on a daily and I guess real-time basis is extremely important to the expedition as a whole. Look, if you're interested in the Great Barrier Reef, if you're interested in coral reef science or just interested in general, you'll be able to see what we've been seeing out here on the reef. The things we can do for the, for the reef, uh, not only here in Australia, but coral reefs worldwide, it's not too late. 